Okay guys, so maybe, just maybe, if you are a rod, you will recognize where I am because we used to bring the kids to this park years and years ago. And I just need to get out of Dodge today, so I brought me and the girls to the park. Just me and my girls. No grandbabies, no, no guys, just me and my girls, okay? So they are hanging out over there. I'm gonna take you guys over there in a little bit, but um, I don't know. Today is just one of those those days, y'all, where I just I was tired of the redundancy of um, you know scenery and not to be ungrateful for anything because y'all know that's the furthest from me. I just needed a, a little bit of a you know kick in the butt. This is the way I do that. Just throwing something in the mix that. I wasn't planning on doing but I'm doing it anyway so it goes to show that it's great to sometimes be um, sporadic is that the word or um, what's the word y'all know the word spontaneous that's the word spontaneous that's what today is being spontaneous and just seeing where that takes us and where and what we can find in the midst of that so just to give you guys my view, the park has changed dramatically. I'm gonna show y'all some of the things in the next coming clips, but I think we ended up here on a day where there are those that are on the spectrum. I feel like they definitely have changed the park to be able to accommodate, um, you know, those that are on the spectrum in, in whatever capacity. Um, and I love that. We've been at other parks where we saw some of those features. And so I can kind of see that here as well. Um, but there are our everyday toddler families out here as well. I love that there is a lot of diversity um, present as well and that makes me happy. That makes me very happy because that's what life is about. It's about diversity. No matter what age you are, on the spectrum, off the spectrum, like being able to be in the same vicinity with human beings and being okay and comfortable and knowing how to respond and react if something were to pop off to you because, you know, there's always that. So, um, but yeah, I'm going to take you guys around and we're going to do some walking um, down here as well and bring you guys along. Say hey, Samara. She made her way over. Don't be making, keep on making that face. Keep it up. Oh my gosh. Oh, my neck is going to be so long. No, it's not. It looks amazing. You got your mother's neck. <laughs> Let's go show them Sammy. I meant not Samara. Halea. So there's the kid. I got to be careful when I'm walking, y'all. There's the kid, the big kid. <laughs> Being a kid, this is what I love. Getting dizzy and falling. <laughs> I didn't fall. Of course you didn't. So this is a new area back here. This area is very much new. And just to give you guys a view, if you would remember this, this is also new, at least since the last time we were here. There's a little um, fountain, kind of water splash area back there. They always have had the basketball courts, but it looks like they've definitely done like a little uplift on them or facelift. And then this whole covered area is new. There's two of them. And then this is the park that we remember. So yeah, it's pretty big. Pretty big, pretty big. This is the park we remember, running down with the kids. Shopping for homecoming. Samira's finally gonna go. That's so pretty. At the notorious phone booth with all of the books. Only get one if you know you're going to read it. Tangerine. It says middle school. Yeah, yeah. This one. Yeah. Is that what it says? Yeah, it says middle Is that what you're talking about now? Is that what you're saying? Is that a cry for help? <laughs> um, you should read this one. I read this one in middle school. Which one is that? Tangerine. Tangerine. Yeah. Helena is not a reader anymore for some reason. I'm not. You would. 
So, hello, you see this right here? It's Tell, show her the price. Feel it. Feel it. Feel the texture. We're working on a project right now with Halea. Oh, and look, look at the exact color as mine, Samir. Don't even play. Do not even play. You see that? You see the zipper? You see the jacket? You see the pull up here? How the collar sits? Mm -hmm. Pay attention to that for later. But it just feels like Then where are the pants? Okay, we got a sports bra. How much was the jacket, Samara? That one over there, 118. Okay, so how much is the sports bra? It's on sale. $49, final sale. Kind of close in color. I'm showing y'all this for a reason. Okay, close in color. I don't see the pants though. Do they have pantalones? Maybe those are it up there. On the wall. So these are the pants that they have, the little lemon. I think mine might be more of a mini flare. So let's just check the price. Even though I don't see the color, but Samira just pointed it out. My favorite place. This is how big I want the doors in our barn dominium. I want it that tall. Why does everything have to have like a super strong scent? The good old anthropology. They're in full fall effect in here today. Samir is trying on a dress because remember I told y'all she's going to homecoming. So not gonna be in here long. Just want to show you guys. something similar to this at home goods this is also glass it's heavy 88 bucks here I think the other one at home goods was an acorn this is where Halea wants to be with all the little itty bitty goodies I told her not to touch anything. We got the infamous anthropology mirror. Go stand in the mirror. It's just for my eyes so we can see. Go stand over there. Closer, closer. I think I figured this would fit you. You almost need like an extra small or something. You hear? Extra, extra small. Put your feet up like you have on heels. If you have braids, it would be I just can't see it fully right now. Yeah, it's too big. Well in advance. This is kind of a part of that. 
And it's not a big raise experience if there aren't flies. Remember how the one in South Tampa had flies too? We're on the water. Is it tomorrow? Don't be extra greedy and then baby I got us some onion rings. Dad and I want fries too. didn't smile for y'all in any of the other clips but you know typical her got some ice cream. No, it's cause the, um, okay. we're no longer hangry so we feel better and we're getting cooled down now because it's florida still and humid humid <laughs> they didn't follow the thing the big kids are over there across the way let me show you guys them much better camera i know everybody got their pick one what did you get one got one. One got key lime. One got key lime pie. We got cookies and cream. Jeremiah, what'd you get? One. One. Joseph one got cookies and cream. Well, me. Did as well. me and um, no. Me and Joseph. We got the mint cookies and cream. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It's called Bright Ice Scoop Shop. I got strawberry balsamic something. I don't remember, but I, I captured it for y'all. Roasted strawberries. Yes. And balsamic. Yeah, it's good. It's got like a little tartness to it, which makes it very delicious. This guy always got a face for y'all. But I'm gonna continue enjoying this and we'll check back with y'all in a little bit. Like I said, it's somebody's birthday, but we ain't gonna say who it is. We ain't gonna say who it is. Mm. A little waffle chip too.